Okay, here we are at Clear Lake, California in the Delta Wine Division. 118 boats go out there. This lake has been a roller coaster of weather, and these two guys take 23.79, and this little guy, as small as he is, catches the big old pig award, the toad of the day. The Lunker guy, he catches a 1040, and he's going to tell us how he does it. But his partner netted it, so without him, it's not a team. There's no I a team. That's right. Because your name is uh, what? Hayden Evans. Zane Kazaka. What was that? Zane Kazaka. Dude, that's like a candy bar. Yeah. Dude, Zane Kazaka. That's one of those things you pull down and you eat. <laughs> Remember those? Remember that when you were a kid? You're thinking about it right now, aren't you, dude? That's exactly what that reminds me of. Remember those, those candy bars? Never mind. So it even show my age. <laughs> all right, they got a little cool looking stripes all over them. You remember the things? Yeah, he's laughing at me because he remembers them. That's bad. So, how'd you catch that big fish, man? Caught it on an underspeed. Like 10 foot of water off a tule point. Okay, and uh, so how? Underspan, what color? Gold head. Gold head with a rain, uh, rainbow shad kite tech on there. And uh, how many ounces was that bait? Uh, three eighths. Three eighths ounces. Yep. How many fish you catch on that bait all day? One. Caught, you caught one Wait, fish. No. We caught two, but one was really small. There you go. So you caught a 1040 and a small one? Yeah. So what did you catch fish on? The Rick Klein Freak deep diving crank bait. How many did you catch? Like four. Like four or five? Four or five. Yeah. We had one drop shot fish, but we couldn't get rid of it. Couldn't What's your uh, personal best fish? 1040. Nice. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this guy just caught his personal best today. You gotta love that. I love it. Now, did you know, did you pre fish this area? We pre fished, uh, we pre fished Wednesday, we pre fished Friday. We never, we never caught any real big fish. We caught like one five pounder, but uh, didn't catch any understood fish. That was my first understood fish this year. So it's like a first, 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 yeah, all the way around. Yeah. Fishing with a candy bar, and then you catch a fish. Yep, yep, yep. Eyes closed and everything. You know what? It's sometimes, somebody was asking me about, uh, they would fish tournaments if there would be like some type of a, like they do, where they get, uh, guys would get like extra weight because of uh, they're not as good as others. I'm like, oh, that's good, let's get ribbons. Yeah. So you're back to the situation of, you went out there, you didn't have a great pre-fish, but you went for it, and you catch a 1040. And when you catch it at 1040, how'd your net man do? He did great. We almost lost it. Uh, the big fish took me for a loop. He, he went underneath the boat, took off, and he stripped drag like nothing. He was mad. Uh, uh, tell me. Tell you what. How'd you net <laughs> that fish, dude? How I netted it? Well, it was about to jump, and I swooped him up. <laughs> that whole thing. That's how it went. It was digging, and it came out, and he pulled it back, and I grabbed him with the net. That's the description right there, guys, right there. Fish came, swooped, net. There it is, done. Fish is in the boat. In the boat. Slapping five? Yep. Any boats here, you catch it? Yeah, actually, someone watched the schedule. And they went, they applauded too? I don't know. They, they, they were kind of far off, but they, were, they, they, they started coming to the spot a little faster after that. These guys caught a 1040 Lunker Club, third place of the tournament. Give these guys a round of applause if you would here at Clear Lake.